Right, uh, I'm at London Bridge now, uh, so I'm just going to meet my friend. It's the 3rd of August. This is when the Eat Out and Help Out program start happening. So, I'm just gonna meet my friend, and then we're gonna go eat some food, and I'll show you guys what we have in today. I'm very excited, so let's go. There is this guy. There you have it. And now we are on our way to an infamous Portuguese place. What's the Portuguese place? Come on. We're going to have a cheeky one. All right. <laughs> so, from where I live, this is good. Uh, it's only like a five minute walk uh, from London Bridge. So, this is where we're going. So, hopefully. Uh, it's quiet because normally uh, when I go during lunchtime or in the evening it's quite quiet because no one knows about this. So let's see. So today is a very very sad day, okay? So we got to Nando's uh, and going to the queue and guess what I said? I said it's two hours wait so we are not going to admit anyone else, anyone at all, right? So it's a sad day. Um, you guys, I can show you guys the, you know, how busy it is, the queue uh, was massive and God knows how long people will take in there as well when they eat, you know, um, so yeah, so this point, however, now we're going to uh, Liverpool Street, uh, so found a new place, so we're calling up beforehand just to make sure we don't do the same mistake again, uh, and so we're going there now, uh, so just going to see how it is and hopefully it's good, I haven't been there, um, I don't think the hell's been there either uh, but you know apparently it's good uh, because I've heard it before as well so let's see how it is let's go Right guys, uh, we just got here uh, and we are at this amazing place that people have been talking about even before the lockdown. Uh, and this place called, as you see this, Absurd Bird, because you know how much I love my chicken, right? <laughs> so, yeah, so we're gonna get a place. Uh, we've got a place now, so um, we're gonna order some stuff and try it and see how it is. Uh, but it's good here, there's no one here, surprisingly. Um, so I don't know whether it's actually good or not, uh, but let's try it and, and we'll see how we do. Um, we'll order a couple of stuff, um, yeah, let's see. Right, so how what have we ordered? Um, we ordered chicken or waffles. Yep. Um, I think it's with gravy yep. and maple syrup. And maple syrup, the weirdest thing ever. But That should be interesting. <laughs> but chicken and waffles, yeah, this is not where I'm from. Mm. I like it. But we ordered a burger and it's almost like this. It's a hot one. Kimchi. Is it kimchi? Kimchi. Kimchi, kimchi burger. burger. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Mac and cheese. And also got mac and cheese. And Korean barbecue wings. 
and Korean barbecue wings. So, yeah, I don't think this is the place to get Korean barbecue wings. Well, we'll just have to wait and see. He yep. said they were. Well, when when I looked at the reviews online, um, they said uh, they were like double jointed. Yep. And they still join when they come, which, which is a bit annoying. But maybe it will help keep some of the flavor. Cool. Uh, but yeah, I'm super excited, I'm super hungry. The burger is good. It's very spicy, bro. Even for me, that spicy, but it's good. Um, the chicken is crispy, but the bun is not that good. It's, it's, it's a little bit tough, it's a little bit hard, but who said that? Huh? Yeah, they should have toasted the bun a little bit so it's soft, but it feels like just all half the package. But um, apart from that, the chicken is fresh, it's good. Um, the salad they put in it, like some tomato, lettuce, it's good, uh, but the bun could be a little bit better, but it's okay for me. Mm. That's actually good. Yeah. No? I think I'm a bit off. It's, def it's definitely very cheesy, right? But, mm. I like it. Yeah, they, they definitely put some spices in there um, and pepper. You can, taste, you can taste the pepper, a lot of pepper. But, I've said that, they must have you know, some, put some other seasoning in there as well. But, um, I think I like that the most so far, actually. But, mm. good. I think that's fresh. Yeah, that's definitely fresh. Not like the final so. <laughs> well, let, let's try the waffle. Yeah. So we've got the maple syrup waffle. So let's see. Mm. That is super good. The waffle is definitely fresh, that's for sure. And the maple syrup, it's not that sweet actually. So try it. Try it. Mm. It's not that sweet at all, surprisingly. Right? You don't want it too sweet. Yeah, I don't want it too sweet. Yeah, no, that's for sure. But the, wa the waffle is good. So let's try the chicken. I assume the chicken would be the same as the burger. So it's crispy on the outside. Um, let's see if it's nice on the inside. So, white chicken and maple syrup. <laughs> That's it. I say some people I'm like sure. it. It's one, I think it's one of those things that you hate it or you love it. Mm -hmm. Did you like? I like it. I did the chicken without the sauce. Mm -hmm. And what's the other sauce? Um, mm. uh, I quite like it actually with, with um, the maple syrup with the chicken. Can't complain on that. This is this is good. The, the outside is definitely crispy. Maple syrup. And it's fresh as well, so can't complain. Loving life right now. <laughs> Right, that's good. So now we're going to move on 
Huh? Gravy. Gravy. Yeah, the other sauce is gravy, and then we'll maple syrup. And now we're gonna move on to the wings and see how it is. Mm. It's okay. I mean, it is quite big because you get the whole joint. Um, it's not that crispy. I just imagine it'd be a little bit more crispy, so I say it's probably not that crispy. For Korea, which is so, but having said that, it's, it's okay, it's okay, but it could be definitely crispier. But in terms of the sauce, it's, it's good, it's sweet, uh, definitely tastes barbecue and the sesame seeds you can see. Uh, it's good on top, but it could be crispier. So, right, we have finished, we have demolished all the food. Uh, it, it was good, it was not too bad. Um, the bill comes to 25 quid, uh, well that's uh, 5 quid service charge, so actually we spent about 10 quid each, actually pretty good uh, with all the food that we've ordered so far anyway. Um, but having said that, um, the food was okay, uh, it wasn't great, uh, the things I would definitely order uh, if I do go again uh, would be definitely mac and cheese, uh, the waffle and the uh, chicken uh, but apart from that the rest is okay um, I wouldn't say it was great uh, would I come again would I recommend it um, maybe maybe not um, wouldn't be my choice I probably would uh, try other places but in terms of if you haven't tried you know waffle and chicken before then I think it's worth trying but apart from that um, I think we're gonna end it for today um, and then we'll see where else we want to go. Um, let me know if there's any other place that we should try out. Um, I'll definitely want to try new food as well. Um, a lesson learned today is no point going to Nando's uh, because the queue is crazy. Um, and also to ring up beforehand. Um, so that's to see if there's any availability. Otherwise, you're going to be waiting uh, for quite a long time. Um, but if apart from that, that thanks for joining in uh, today um, and subscribe and leave a comment to where I should try uh, next time and see you next time. Take care.